Hello, everyone, everybody. Hello. Oh, how beautiful you are. Wow, wow. Oh, I can see better now. <laughs> Yeah, so it is such an honor to be here to share this poem, this brand new still in development poem. It's growing and changing as we speak, still uh, working it out. Um, you know, I've been very, very moved. I, I wanted to create something uh, really beautiful, but uh, when I went to this, uh, to this artist residency, residency, but the news has really affected me, our news here in this country. Uh, my grandmother, uh, she was born in San Antonio, Texas, and she fell in love with a man across the border in Mexico. And she crossed the border, and uh, she had kids with, uh, with him in Mexico. And uh, all of her children, or many of them, were deaf. And so she decided to come back over into the United States with her children. She went into Texas again, uh, and she put her children into the Texas School for the Deaf. And here I am now, um, because I'm able to share this stage with my beautiful daughter, Cataline, who you saw earlier. Moi, I love you. Um, yeah, Cataline performed in Stepchild. So um, I wanted to do this poem for all of you. And um, we're not going to have any voice interpretation for this at all. Um, and I invite all of you to use your eyes to really see with your heart. Uh, the name of my poem, the title is Making, Make Dreams Great Again. Um, I'm using some hand shapes that you may notice that I use certain hand shapes over and over again. This one, which is the S hand shape. I use this hand shape here and this one repeatedly throughout the poem. And I think that's pretty much it. I think so, yeah. So, okay, so um, I'm just going to go ahead and, and, and do this poem. <laughs> 